that, lovely peeps. I hope you're all doing wonderful today, and I hope you are ready for another Sims 4 episode of my Not So Berry series. Quick recap, Redlin aged up into an elder, and we got some of BB's skills up as well. And unfortunately, we were unsuccessful to find a Shih Tzu puppy. So in this episode, hopefully we can find one, but we're gonna be pretty busy in this episode because I have a lot of stuff to do. Because he is engaged to Sophia, we have to have an engagement party tomorrow, and we have to have a rehearsal dinner. All day today, we can work on Bumblebee skills and as well find a Shih Tzu puppy. So we're gonna have him do that at the computer. Household, adopt, and adopt dog. So I'm hoping that Bumblebee's first day won't be so bad because she's a loner. She does not want to be around anybody. I think she'll have a good day. As long as we have her focus on her work, she should be fine. Does not look like we have any Shih Tzus. Oh, and it's a female. All of these dogs are so cute. I wanted a puppy, but we could just get Waffle. Waffle's adorable. Now this is what I was thinking. A very fluffy dog like Dahlia. We're gonna do a friendly introduction. Let's see if she loves us. Okay, we got along so far. We can pet her. Okay, fine. We'll have Sophia do all of it because she loves animals anyway. We'll do friendly introduction. Let's do this all over again. Ooh, Bumblebee's off to school. Have a good day, Bumblebee. I really hope it won't be terrible. And we're gonna talk to her a little bit. Dahlia has been sprayed by skunk again because she's really good at that. She's a troublemaking dog. What can I say? So I wanna keep her waffle, but I gotta keep the red theme going. It looks like waffle really loves us. So we're gonna adopt her. Yes, I wouldn't to adopt a waffle. We name her Azalea. I think I spelled it right. Yes, I did. There we go. All right, Azalea, let's give you a little makeover. And we could see a little bit more detail just for this shade or just for now. I know it's not as bright and colorful, but just for now. So we have little Azalea here and we need to give her some spray paint. Where would I do that? Oh yeah, does not look like they have roses. <gasps> oh, I could do a little kiss sign or a little moon sign. Oh, that was so cute. Oh, should we put them on like her little cheeks? <gasps> so cute. I love it. Now I think it's a little bit out. Yeah, it is a little. It's okay. She could have a little hoodie. Look at that. So cute. And it has hearts on it. Oh, what about these? All these are cute. Nah, I'm not gonna do it. I'm gonna do this dark red one. I feel like she would have a bow too. I've seen two dogs that where they both have bows. I do want to add another outfit and I want to add a cute wedding outfit. Ooh, that one's so cute. Cuteness overload here. Okay, okay. I'm done. I'm done with the dogs. I want to quickly change her hairstyle. Give her a little bit more of a school look, even though she's already at school. Something along the lines of that without the bows, probably. She's always gonna wear that necklace that was given to her by her grandmother on her birthday. I don't think she would be allowed to wear earrings at this school, so we're gonna take those off. I kind of want this headband to be yellow or black, but they don't have any other options like that. Probably not gonna be able to do the bow. We are done here. And who is calling Bumblebee? It's probably grandma. Oh no, it's a toddler. Why is a toddler wanting to come over. All right, you need to write some jokes and I think you can do that on the computer. We really need her to start getting promoted because she has not been promoted in a long time. She's a happy girl. Look at her little bum bum. Ooh, manage the intern. Redlin has been assigned an intern to train manage. How should he handle it? We're gonna assign them to coffee duty. All right, I hope she's not talking to anybody. No. She can listen to teacher, leave school early, do homework in class. Ooh, she can play with toys and make enemies. So we're just gonna have her listen to teacher. She needs to really pay attention and she acquired the charisma skill. Ooh, a motor skills, typing from other sims. Oh, and it's mental skills. Why is she scared? Oh, from the fire yesterday. Just take a shower if you're sprayed by a skunk. So while she's writing some jokes, I don't want her to spend some time with the doggos a little bit. And Pepper, you can make another friendship bracelet. <gasps> oh yes, we made another one. So now we have two friendship bracelets so we can give those to Bumblebee and her. Bumblebee's manners is range to earn good manners trait. Yay! That's exactly what we wanted her to be trained as. Oh, we're done here. You did not sleep last night, young lady. How's it come along, Pepper? You getting the beanie done? Looks like you are. I told you to use the restroom. I didn't tell you to fill up the water. Why is she using the restroom all the way upstairs? Knitting project complete. Yay. She's done with the beanie. And Bumblebee is done with school for the first day. She's doing satisfactory work, but her teachers at Landgrab Elementary think she could easily improve with just a little bit of extra effort. 
effort. Progress will be awarded the project completed. I've never done a project with a child. Isn't that so funny? Because we didn't do projects with Redland or Athena. Excuse me. No, 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 no. You're not doing that. You're not going to be able to do any schoolwork if you are this tired. So I'm going to have you take a little nap. You're not scared. You'll be fine. I thought I put a mirror in here, but I guess not. Ooh, did she draw a little rainbow? She did. She drew something at school. It's a solar system project. Oh, this episode is just getting better because this is what we wanted. I wonder if we should just get rid of this and put the solar system there. Hmm, I wonder if we should have the project outside. It's a solar system. Well, she's not going to sleep anytime soon. I want to do the solar system with you. I want you to do your homework. You're just gonna pass out and then you had a nightmare so now you can't go back to sleep. This is one hectic day, I'm telling ya. Okay, you got some sleep, that's a plus, and he's just watching over you. This is kinda creepy. He's already getting super late. I need her to just wake up. You don't need to talk to your son. You need to be with your granddaughter. Bumblebee responsibility range to earn responsible traits. Yay, she's gonna be a responsible child. And her homework's complete. What do you mean losing a grandparent? <gasps> Clara passed away! I know I'm very cruel, but finally we won't get all these weird phone calls. Assist with project. What are you doing going to bed? I know you're old, but you need to help your granddaughter. I don't care how late you guys need to stay up. She's so bored. Well, this will entertain you. More worky worky, less talky talky. Oh, hello, Sophia. Welcome back. All right, let's give these dogs some attention before you do anything else. Because her mother passed away, we need to cheer up. And what's a better way of playing with your dog? Oh, and baby just passed out. You know what? I think Bumblebee doesn't care for dollhouses, so she just destroyed it. She's like, nah, I don't want Castle Luru anymore. I want to set with the astronaut, the aliens, and the UFOs, and all of the planets, and the solar systems. I don't know where we can find that kind of set, but does Legos work? Bumblebee finished her school project quickly. Extra credit has been awarded. Yay! Good job, Bumblebee. Look at that. Bumblebee and her grandmother did that. That is so beautiful. Okay, yes. Now you can go to bed because you did your project and your schoolwork. I'm so proud of you for staying up till 1 a.m. doing it. Next morning is starting out pretty smooth. Everyone's gonna probably have to sleep in, except for this little girl. She only had a little bit of sleep. Well, she had a decent amount, but she does need to get up pretty early. She has all of these moods she's got to work on. Pack a leftover lunch for her. So, I think what would be nice is we get a ham and cheese sandwich. We're taking PTO. He's have not really taken PTO in a while. Veggie hummus sandwich is definitely something we would make. And veggie hummus sandwiches are so good. Just gotta eat her greens, man. Don't just stand there. Make your daughter's lunch, please. Hurry the heck up, Radlin. She's going to school. Okay, did he make it? <gasps> he didn't make it into a sack. You're supposed to make into a sack lunch. Okay, we're just gonna say yes for now, just so she can have a sack lunch. Oh, she went anyway. Okay, there we go. Now she's going to school with a sack lunch. Ooh, nice work, Bumblebee. Completing school projects really has a positive impact on your grade. Keep up the good work. I will. What is she? She's a C student. That's not bad. Engagement dinner is about to begin. Okay, there we go. <gasps> Grades are up. Bumblebee has been working hard and is now a grade B student. Great job, Bumblebee. Okay, so we need to have toasts, grab plates of dessert, and celebration feast. We need a big table and some chairs. Do we have any of that? Everyone sit down. Why are you dressed up like that? Honestly, I'm kind of digging it. I like the headphones. Very nice. Looks like you are a gamer. Serve assortment of food, please. And I hope there's an assortment of vegetarian. All right. So we're going to give some toasts called tendies to activity request toast. Someone grabbed a plate of dessert. This is already becoming a great success in my opinion. We need to have good relationships with everybody to ask them to be in the wedding. Oh, there we go. Activities ask to be ring barrier at wedding. So you're gonna be the ring bearer. And we're going to ask the Sim of Honor and as well. We're gonna announce engagement to her. We're gonna announce engagement to her. And Sophia, you need to announce engagement to everybody else. There's just so many people. Why the heck did I do this? 
Everyone already gave toasts. We already got dessert. We got celebration feast. I think we are good to go. So everyone's just dancing it out. It is eight. Oh, it's nine, which means this little girl has to go to bed soon because she has work tomorrow. I don't think Pepper gave a toast. Can you give a toast, Pepper? Like, congratulations, Redlin. <laughs> Sophia needs to go to the bathroom, you poor girl. All right, now he needs to go home. It's 1 a.m. It is late, but it's not as late as I thought it was going to be. Oh, well, now it's going to be 3 a.m. Why do I do that? I could just do it myself. The next day. And the rehearsal dinner starts in one hour. Two hours, actually. Man, I know they keep breaking. You guys need to stop fixing them. We'll just fix them tomorrow. And you're going to get a salad for dinner. Oh, she wanted to help her with her homework. Oh, her responsibility tray went back up. Yay! And her homework is complete. I know it's a rehearsal dinner, but she doesn't have to attend. She's just going to build. It's raining. I don't like it. Oh, that means everyone's gonna have to be indoors. Look at all these people. And we need to serve some teas. I don't know what she said. <laughs> Did he make a Caesar salad or is that for her? How do I serve tea to people? Like it says serve tea. Click on a tea set to steep, pour, and serve tea. It says tea set. Does it mean what I think? think it means since he is the only one here we're just gonna have to have you steep some tea Ooh, orange blossom even though we're not an orange gen why is everyone inside my office and who are you oh it's yasmin you need to be calmed by the orange blossoms all right it says we're supposed to dance can i edit and get rid of that because i don't want us to dance why is it not giving me the option to dance i wouldn't really call that a successful tea party but we had one so that's all that matters it's bad luck for the groom to see the bride before the wedding so we're gonna have her enter her room and just put on her wedding dress that she took took hours to find and a lot of money to bu to buy it with this is her bridesmaid dress and yes she is going to the restroom i don't know how she can do that with the dress on and this is her wedding dress so no she's about to see the groom before the wedding yeah no <gasps> she did not oh she did this is very upsetting i knew they were going to do that i just want this wedding to be as simple as possible guys okay i do not want the wedding to be chaotic exchange wedding vows yes don't have a bouquet because I didn't go buy one. Has people shown up yet? I don't know if people are here. Oh, well, looks like there are people. Nice, nice, nice. Look at Minami and some other dude. Please take your seats, everyone. Gonna exchange vows and kiss. And here we go. We're gonna start their wedding day and their vows. Everyone gather around, please, for the bride and groom, aka the president and his soon-to-be wife. Oh, you're all just gonna sit down like that? That's fine. Hey, is she arriving? She is. Look at her in her beautiful dress. After five, six, probably seven years of just being together, having a baby together, they're now officially going to tie the knot and he's going to have a wife. She has supported him. He's supported her. They love each other very much. Even though he's an old age, she does not care. This is the moment we've all been waiting for. And now the groom is sick. He's dizzy. He's like, I am dizzy with love right now. Yeah, I bet you are. Oh, well, that, that uh, didn't go as planned. No! You're supposed to pause when you're gonna kiss each other! Are they married now? Hang on, sometimes my game bugs up. I have to always check and make sure. The love of his life, it's such a beautiful thing. We got sunshine and roses here. Sunshine and roses. Okay, I'm pausing the game. It is 7 p.m. They are married and everyone has some weird clothing, just a little bit. I loved how her parents were exchanging their vows and she was just here playing with the monkey bars. Look at you, Bumblebee. I can't believe you would do that to your own parents. Like, eh, I live with them. I see them every day. You know what? You're right. We're gonna fill the fountain with chocolate. This chocolate sounds great. And you gotta have a chocolate fountain at a wedding. You're going to request toast from your mother-in-law. Then Red Link, you give a toast and then that's it. Ooh, look at the chocolate. No cake. No cake yet. Do not eat cake. Put cake down. Thank you. There you are. What do you think you're doing, sir? I don't care if you're hungry. You're gonna tend to the bar. And I wish I did this at morning time instead of night. Why did I do this? Prepare a bar drink, please. They need some drinks. Except for you, you're a teenager, so you're not allowed to. Think he just rejected that. I don't know. Okay, next thing. So we have spousal kiss. We have exchange vows. I need someone to throw some rice. Can you? Oh, you know what? It's fine. We're going to leave her alone because she does like to stay in her room. 
and she can get her skills up at that. Ooh, she's giving a toast. There we go. We got some lighting going on, but I mean, not, not a lot of lighting. We got toasts. I need you to throw some rice. Can you do that? I love how the whole wedding is just chilling around here. It's cold though, so everyone's inside their winter wear, and it's not what I wanted. We're gonna have Callie give a speech because she is a best friend, but you're looking the wrong direction, sir. I'm sorry that it's cold. It did not plan any of this. No one's even sitting in their seats. You know what? I don't even why I bother making it look so pretty in here. Okay, everyone gather for the first dance, please. So you need to come over here, have your first dance with Sophia. No, you are not going to bed. You are not going to bed. No, this wedding is going to be a good wedding. Please, please come over here. At least this is a cute moment here. Except for the Sims always want to go inside our way. We're just going to have him feed a piece. Oh, now you guys, oh, now you guys decide to slow dance. Everything that was going on in the wedding, they just prefer to dance like this. Yeah, she needs to go to the restroom. You're going to feed a piece to Sophia because that's the whole point of marriage, I guess. I gave you guys a chocolate fountain. I gave you a bar. I gave you a buffet. Oh, wait, I didn't give you the buffet. <laughs> huh, huh. Let's give you a assortment of food. Everyone gather for cake, please. Oh, she's going to the restroom. Look at all these faces. These faces of disappointment. Like, oh, this was not such a great wedding, was it? No, not really. I wonder if the game's on. Oh, he's mad because he's missing the game. He's missing the high scores. Everyone rather be home or do something else instead of being this wedding. You can definitely tell. We're not going to stuff her face with cake. That's fine. She doesn't want to do that. She's like, no, I need to go to the bathroom because do what I want. I'm like, okay, we'll go relieve yourself then. Did we get cake? Are are we done with everything? Yes, we're done. Should I just end it? Everyone seems to be having such a good time. You didn't want the social event end soon, did you? I do, because it's almost 1 a.m. She's napping. She's like, I don't care for anything. It's okay, no one's really having a blast out there. And you're smart for staying in here, staying away from those people, because you are already sick. It's too late. We'll just have you wake up early, and you could take a bubble bath tomorrow to relax before school. She's asleep. She just went straight to bed. Well, she's old. She has to get some sleep. She can't stay up all the time. I'm just saying, your mother woke up at 3 a.m. making this cake for both of you and this is how you repay her make up your mind Radlin. he has no idea where to sit yeah no one is listening to me and their needs i'm gonna say that this wedding was a complete fail i'm going to end it <sighs> Oh, man. Hey, at least you guys got the vows and everything out of the way. It says everyone's having fun, but I really don't think anyone is. So for future reference, I think I'm just going to use regular tables instead of umbrella tables because they're just getting really confused here. And I'm going to use benches so they can sit and actually watch the ceremony because I think it was kind of messed up of them to have to slid on, sit on the floor. Is Yuki pregnant? <gasps> Yuki, you're pregnant again? You're gonna have a baby? Are you gonna pop a child? Oh my gosh. No, 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 no. You are not going in that bed smelling like that. Stop it. I don't know if I got a gold trophy for it, but completed everything. Okay, everyone go home, please. Everyone go home so I could sell all of this. <laughs> Well, everyone has officially gone home. The wedding's done. They have now officially got married, which means we are now officially done with Rose Gen. I hope you guys enjoyed the Rose Generation series because of all the heartbreaks and the hardworking and just the hardheadedness of him with everything. It was very hard. And these two were struggling to have a baby in the first place and she was almost gonna have twins, but I changed that so we could have this girl. Next episode is going to be Yellow Gen and I cannot wait. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.